Welcome back everyone. It's Najwa with Sustained 8. Today, I want to do a demonstration on how to use our illustrious compost tea bag. Now, one of the things we're generally asked is, well, can I drink compost tea? Absolutely not. This is not for human consumption. Instead, it is to support or quickly support the health of your soil and ultimately the root systems of your growing plants. Now, remember, this is one way to use finished compost. So Sustain 8 has conveniently placed it inside of this mesh bag and we're selling these also online, okay? So the first thing you wanna do is to remove the sticker off of the compost tea bag because you do not wanna immerse this sticker in the water along with the mesh bag. I also wanna let you know on the back of this sticker is a QR code that you can hit that goes to the website and you can find more information under what should I do with my compost tea bag? And right there is all of these wonderful instructions and then also links to the tools to get you started, okay? So in the previous post, you noticed that I listed all of the tools. So today I'm gonna to go ahead and get started. The first thing is you want is to immerse your air stone of your aquarium bubbler in dechlorinated water, okay? So once that gets started, you can go ahead and take your sugar source or molasses and pour about a tablespoon of molasses into the bubbling water. Now it's important to know that one compost tea bag can yield you about 2.5 to five gallons of compost tea. Another note, do not use direct tap water. You wanna use dechlorinated water and the quickest way to get to dechlorinated water is to allow that tap water to sit out for at least 24 hours because that way the chlorine will dissipate off of the water, okay? So remember folks, dechlorinated water. So I have my bubbler already in, it's bubbling. I've added my sugar source. And I also wanna add that molasses or a sugar source, and some people use potato for sugar, is important because the tiny microorganisms inside of this compost tea bag need a food source. So sugar acts as the food source when the nutrients and the microorganisms are all interacting as they get bubbled up, if you will. Okay, so the last thing you're gonna do is take your compost tea bag and immerse it into the water. So I already have a compost tea bag bubbling into the water and I just tied it onto the side of the bucket. So just like a herbal tea bag, it is now immersed into the water, okay? So keep in mind that this is going to bubble for no more, and I repeat, no more than 48 hours. That's your cutoff time. And then you wanna immediately use the compost tea on your soil or your house plants or your cash crops. And cash crops are basically plants that you grow for consumption or that you wanna eat, okay? So remember, compost tea is highly perishable, so use it immediately. Do not use straight tap water and take the sticker off your compost tea bag. Again, I'm Najwa with Sustain 8, as always, Keep sustaining yourself and your planet. And don't forget, the holidays are coming up. So I would love for you all to go over to sustain8.com and purchase some awesome holiday swag for your loved ones. All right, stay tuned. We'll have more for you soon. Have a good one.